Okay, here with uh, Brad Fritsch after a 664 in the final round of the RBC Canadian Open. Brad, uh, a laser show out there. Um, just comment on your ball striking to start off with. Uh, hit it really well in the front and, and missed a bunch of putts and kind of felt like, you know, hopefully that wasn't, that's not what the day was going to be, I hoped. And uh, on the back, I finally made a couple putts, made a long putt for Eagle on 12, and that kind of got it going. And then hit it close on uh, 14 and 15 and snuck those in. So, um, Really happy, and especially coming down 16, 17, 18, I hit really good shots. Uh, the putts didn't go, but at the same time, I hit good putts, and that's all you can ask. Uh, you're in a top 10 position right now. Um, what are your emotions? Are you are you thrilled with how you finished, or is there a little bit of, you know, it could have been even lower out there today? Well, it could have been. Golfers are always, you know, saying, ah, oh, one more, two more. But, uh, you know, if I, had, <laughs> if I had made him on 16, 17, 18, I think that would have been like 27 on the back or something. And, you know, you don't get that once in your life. So, um, you know, to ask for that is uh, a steep request, I think. So I'll, t I'll take today every day. Set aside, set aside for a moment that it's the Canadian Open that you've played well in. How big is this for your season right now um, as we get down to just a few tournaments left? Uh, just trending in the right direction. I said it after the John Deere when I finished tied for 13th. Um, you know, if I just keep playing like this, I'll be fine. And whether I you know, just miss the playoffs or just miss 150 or whatever it is. As long as I keep playing well, uh, I'll be okay. And that's what I what I want to see for myself. I know it's extra special doing in the Canadian Open, but also, you know, Montreal is not too far from Manitech. There was a lot of Rideau View members here, your, your family and friends. How, how cool was it to, to play like that in front of them? It was really cool. Um, you know, they, they've always been so supportive of me, especially right at the beginning of my career when I needed the money to start and uh, they stepped up and and gave me all the money I needed. So, uh, you know, they keep guys like me going when we struggle early on in our careers. So uh, it's great to have the belief, the support of all the people around me. And uh, it's always nice to have friends follow you. Uh, they don't get a chance to do it very often, so it's really special. Last question for you. It's, it's, un, it's undecided right now, but there's a chance you'd be low Canadian. Um, how does that, is that a, is it a big deal to you to be low Canadian, Canadian Open? I thought about it once or twice during the round as I started to make more birdies. And, uh, you know, I hope Graham makes four or five more birdies and passes me, you know, because um, I want to see him have a shot at the win. But, uh, you know, I wouldn't turn it down. And, uh, you know, um, I'm just glad I played well. And if that happens to be the case, then great.